Hey guys, what's up? It's Monkle Zunky. So yesterday I asked who would be interested in seeing a series which is basically me trying to get the Max Cape again. If you don't know, I already have a main account that does have a Max Cape already. I got that about a month ago. And lately I just haven't been having fun in RuneScape, so I decided um, what I'm going to do is plan a new account and see how that goes. So I played on this account which I did create uh, roughly 11 months ago last summer. And um, I played on it quite a bit then, but uh, just recently in the past week or so I have been playing again on this account. I got it membership again, and I've been working on getting some levels. And it's been an absolute blast, and I thought this is so much fun. I really enjoyed maxing out the first time, so hey, why not do it again? And uh, we'll see how, how it goes. I don't know for sure if I will get a max cape on this account, but um, there's no harm in setting that as my goal and striving towards it and making a really cool video series. So I do have quite a bit of clips recorded of the past three days of some levels that I have got. But before we jump into those, I'm just going to show you guys really quick um, what I spent all my money on. I had about um, 9.8 mil or 10 mil cash, roughly in that range. And I decided to buy some papaya trees seeds because I want to train farming. Um, and papaya tree seeds were buying for 24k each today, which is like insanely cheap. The cheapest I've ever seen these. Um, so what I decided to do is buy quite a few of those. And it's really cheap experience because even after you plant the papaya tree, you get like six papayas back, which is like 8k. Um, so essentially, you're only paying like 16k for a seed. Um, so it's a very cheap experience. And I also bought some calquat saplings because those are, those are very cheap experience as well. Um, so this is about 10 mil worth of farming. I have 100 seeds in my inventory, 100 papaya saplings already planted. And I have uh, yet another 100 still buying in the GE. Uh, after a few hours, those should buy. I'm just at my limit right now. Um, and then, of course, the calquat saplings. They would cost about 16k each or something like that. But anyway, I will be planting those, so I'll be getting some great farming levels from that. Um, and anyway, what I have been working on lately is getting my levels to uh, get the Temple at Sentisten quest done. Um, and I needed to level up some skills. So most of the levels that you'll be seeing are me getting the levels for the, the quest line that I need to complete. Um, all I need left is one more thieving level and four more mining levels, and then I will be questing quite hard for a while and get that Temple at Sentisten quest done and unlock curses. But anyway, that's all for my little spiel here. Uh, I'm going to show the clips now. Hopefully you enjoy, and uh, I should have another of these pretty soon because it doesn't take long to get levels in this account, so I can stock up on, click on clips very fast. Uh, hopefully you guys will enjoy the series a lot, and I'm really excited for it. Okay, so the first clips that I decided to record was at the Thieves Guild. Um, I spent my time doing the lure and um, pickpocket, where you basically blackjack the advanced pickpocketing trainer or the Koshin volunteers. Not sure how to pronounce that. But anyway, it is pretty fast. Um, I only did this until level 61 because I wanted to switch to Pyramid Plunder. Um, this method is a little bit faster than Pyramid Plunder, even after level 61, but it's just much more click intensive. Um, and the way my mouse is set up right now, it actually is pretty hard to click perfectly, just because my mouse is like on the very edge of the table, because I have my computer set up on a really small table. Um, but here I got 65 smithing. I went from 60 to 65 in like one sitting, and it didn't take very long. I was not able to record any of the other levels just because smithing was so AFK. I was missing every single level because at the moment I was filling out a job application, um, and I wasn't really paying attention to the computer. But um, there is 59 agility. I had to get 61 agility uh, for the qu for one quest. I think it was the Curse of a Rav that you need the agility for. I'm not quite sure. It's one of those quests that I need to do. Um, there's 60 agility. That was pretty cool. I just did almost all of this at the Wilderness Course. Uh, and then I remembered about Troll Invasion when I was actually really close to 61 agility. So I got 61, and uh, at the moment I'm very close to 62 agility as well, which is pretty nice. Uh, I probably will be using that Troll Invasion on agility uh, for the time being. And then I decided to kill Water Fiends because I needed 64 range for the Curse of a Rav quest. Um, so I decided this is probably the best place to go just because you can get some nice Crimsons for them from the Water Fiends, and also you don't lose money because their drops are pretty nice. I actually may ended up making about 400k just from the drops in Water Fiends, and I went from 56 to 64 range. Uh, it was pretty slow because I was using a, um, a rune two-handed crossbow, uh, which wasn't as bad as I thought it was going to be. You could still hit them, but you did 
uh, miss the water fiends quite often. Um, so here is me getting 63 range, and I missed 64 range because I missed a lot of levels. Because the levels just come so fast, you're not really expecting it, and it just hits you out of the blue, and it's like, bam, there's a level. So, um, yeah, and here is me going to Pyramid Plunder. Uh, I had to get 66 thieving. I am 65 at the moment. So uh, that was 62 thieving, and this should be uh, 63 thieving. I should be getting 66 thieving pretty soon. Um, as soon as I'm done with this video, I will go back to thieving and then get that. And then I only need to grind out four more mining levels, and then I can start questing. I'm really putting off that mining as long as possible because I hate mining below level 80. It is no fun at all. Uh, it's very slow and very boring. Um, but there's 65 thieving. That is all the thieving. And uh, then this last clip is... Um, well, I have two more clips. But this was just earlier this morning because I have been trying to do a farm run every single morning. Um, and some herb runs as well just to make a little bit of money. So that was 72 farming, which was pretty nice. Uh, and then this last clip clip was like the one kind of more major quest that I did, which was the Family Crest. Uh, so I got that one done. Uh, I have done some other quests such as like Demon Slayer, but they're mostly newbie quests and not really worth recording. Um, so anyway, the video is done now clip-wise. Uh, thanks for watching, and uh, stay tuned for the next episode, which should be coming out soon. Uh, it does not take too long to stock up on clips, uh, and hopefully by next episode I will have be nearly done with that questing or completely done with the questing. Uh, however, that ends out. But anyway, thanks for watching, and see you again soon. Farewell.